get the fight announcement, I'm already in shape. Like, let's go, man. I'm going to fucking break your face, man. Uh, everything that you said, we're, we're going to have to see what's up when we get in the, in the cage, you know? This is an individual that obviously, I don't think anybody likes him. Anybody cares for this cup of tea. Somebody's talking about ex-teammates, wives and stuff. Like, for what? You're going to fight the dude or the chick? or the, What is it? You know, you're confused. Um about his life just as much as he is about his sexuality, you know? And it's not that I'm making fun of him for it. It's just like, you're just a confused dude, bro. And I'm going to straighten you out. Would you, you've had some personal fights. I mean, you're just coming off of a personal fight, right? Would you say this is the most personal to you? Yeah, man, I would say they're all business, man. It's just, and it's all business. And, you know, some of the people that I'm running business with are idiots, but it's nothing personal. But if it was to be something personal, this is one of the more closer ones, you know? And that's because, um, I mean, this individual lived in my couch for a year. Yeah. You know, while he had his hand broken, was living off my couch, was eating my meal prep food that they were giving me because I was already a sponsored athlete. He was an amateur coming in to the world, you know. So it, it just makes it like, uh, it just puts a lot of things in perspective. Like, you come into this world alone and you fucking probably go out alone as well, you know. And this guy's a, a legit snake, so I can't wait to. I mean, ask John Jones about it. I'm motherfucking John Jones has nothing nice to say about it. How about Wood 